everybody <clears throat> this is Yelly from Lisa Orville stickers and today I am going to be setting up the month of October and uh, I am going to be using kit 82 from my shop to do that and let's just <clears throat> get started setting up the date covers um, so while I'm doing this let me update you so the advent calendar uh, regular sale is up on Etsy and I did want to let you guys know that um, it's just going to be there for a few weeks. Uh, uh, it's not going to be there indefinitely. So um, if you guys are looking to get an advent, be sure um, to do so as soon as possible. Um, yeah, so what else? Not all the formats made it to the um, regular sale. For those of you that did not jump into the pre-sale, in the pre-sale, all formats I offer in my shop are always available. However, um, if there's a specific format or two that nobody purchased, then in the pre-sale, then that format is not going to be offered in the regular sale, which was the case. And also, um, so the way Etsy works with coupons, it's, you know, the system is not the best for coupons. So what I did was in order to allow for you guys to always use your VIP coupon, because Theoretically, you can't use a coupon on the advent. Um, that's the reason of the pre-sale. That's where you can get it discounted. Um, so I had to tweak the price and you're still getting it cheaper um, than full price when you use your VIP coupon. And for those of you that do not have that VIP coupon, you can totally get it by um, just going ahead and uh, joining my Facebook group and you will see it as one of the announcements or pinned posts. Um, I know it changed. It's not called pinned posts anymore. It's called announcements or featured because it's it's been called so many things. I can't keep track. So I think it's featured posts right now. So um, you'll find it there. And also uh, there's uh, some grab bags out. So those kids that were retiring have retired for good, um, which means that those patterns are not gonna be carried in my shop. I, I can't guarantee that maybe, I don't know, next year I'll bring an old pattern back in a new format of kids, I don't know. Um, but those are going into the archives because I, I need to manage both my digital and physical space appropriately, right? <clears throat> so at some point I need to retire some of the kits. Um, so the next time I will be retiring kits is going to be um, first trimester of next year. Until then, there won't be any more retiring kits. So yeah. Um, what else can I tell you? I'm trying to kind of update you on the shop while I'm setting up the date dots because I know that this is kind of like a boring process for a lot of people um, to watch and even for me to put them down. I mean, this is not the most like um, happy occasion, right? Um, setting these down can be a little bit tedious, but I thought to just update you on the shop. <clears throat> so, um, I have a new smaller PR team for October, so be sure, um, to give them a visit and, uh, you can find them on Instagram. I posted about them on Instagram and I also posted, um, in the Facebook group so you can, um, check the team there with, and, and check the PR codes there as well that you can use to support them and the shop, of course. And um, last but not least, I want to do um, a nice decoration here for Halloween and I want to put the box down 
after I'm done with this. There we go. That's super cute. So a few things that I want to mention. Um, first, I am sorry for being so inconsistent on uploading videos. It's It's been hard. And you guys know that uh, when things get busy, I, I just kind of focus on getting orders out. And that's what I've been doing. But hopefully you'll be seeing more posts from me and from the PR team going forward. Also, um, the other news I have is that we are participating in the Planner Social. Where's my Thursday? Oh, here's the Friday. Okay, that's what I was missing. I was like, well, I'm missing something. What is it? Uh, okay, so uh, we have signed up and I think it's going to be a Black Friday sale. Um, so yeah, it's I'm participating in the uh, Planner Social Black Friday sale. So I'm excited to be one of the shops participating again this year. And uh, I'm getting ready for Black Friday, guys. I'm really hoping that you guys uh, enjoy it. And uh, there's an unexpected item that's going to be part of Black Friday sale. And I hope you guys really, um, you know, take advantage of getting that item because it might very well be uh, one of the last times, if not the last, that you'll be able to get that item. I just don't want to say much because I don't want to ruin anything for anybody. So that's all I'm going to be saying for now. Uh, let me put this down the best way I can. That looks cute. I'm not going to put another box down here because I'd rather just keep this um, <clears throat> empty space. But I could always use it for um, one of these. So what I'll do is that this, this month, what I put here are things that are not tied to a date, but that do need to happen this month. And then what I, I do the next month, and then I can write down things that are coming up next month here as well. And I can always, let me see if I want to do this. Not sure, but I'll try. Like I can set up the important right over here and um, set up a few of the date dots. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have to use this little guy that I peeled out. Sometimes, you know, when it's hard to peel them out, at least you don't peel them out by mistake, but then when it's easy to peel them off, you peel them off by mistake, so. There's always something going on, right? Okay, now let's get into the plans. So, um, uh, on October 3rd, we have cleaning. Hmm, you know what? I'm gonna hold off on the cleaning because I wanna use an icon and I don't have those with me here accessible right now. So, um, let me do, 10 a.m. lashes, which I'll just use this guy here for that. Um, so that is on the 4th, Wednesday, a 10 a.m. appointment for lashes. Then on the 5th, I have an 8.30 appointment for blood work. And then I have a um, noon appointment for manicure. Now let me get these two, 8 a.m., well, 8.30, blood work, and let me start writing it down. <clears throat> so this is lashes, and this is 8.30, blood work, and 12 manicure okay now um on the 6th we have a party 
and I need to remember to pay tuition. So let me just write this. Um, we have a celebration for Hispan Hispanic Heritage Month, and this is going to be a 7 p.m. celebration, and I do need to pay tuition, so let's put that down here. <clears throat> and then let's grab these two guys and put that down. This is happening at the end of the day, so it goes here. Okay, now, um, on the 9th, there's no school and we have a 1020 appointment for the orthodontist. So... Um, oh, it's actually a morning appointment, so let me just go ahead and put it up here, and let me grab the no school. So, what time is it again? 10 what? 1020, orthodontist. 1020, orthodontist, wonderful. Then... My next appointment is on the 12th with my endocrinologist. <clears throat> and we have a 4 p.m. allergy appointment. So we have a couple of appointments. Let me um, use these two guys since we have two that day. And again, this is the 12th. Okay, so on Thursday we have 8.30 a.m. my endocrinologist and endocrine. And at 4 p.m. allergy shots for my daughter. Okay, then on the 13th at 1.55 p.m., It's the beginning of the 24 hours pre prior to the new moon. And I like to always uh, mark that down. And on the 14th, Elisa is going to visit a friend. And uh, on the 18th, I have my lash appointment again at 10 a.m. And at 1.30 p.m., I have, um, I'm going to have to write it down here. So 1.30 p.m., I'm going to be volunteer. That's cool. So let's start putting these down while the other one dries a little bit. Okay, this is on the 14th. And then, um, when is this? The lashes, 18th. On the 18th, I have the lashes appointment and then at 1.30, I'm going to be volunteering at the school and then I pick her up from there and from there we're heading back home. Now on the 19th, I'm not sure how this is going to work out for me. So I need to try and figure that out. I have an 8.30 a.m. parent forum at the school. But then I also have a 10 a.m manicure and pedicure. So that's gonna be a little complicated to be able to achieve both of those. And I don't think I'll be able to do both, but we'll see. Maybe I will, I don't know. At least I might be able to be there for 45 minutes at the parent forum. So yeah, at least you know, I'll be like, I'm here, but I'm sorry, I have an appointment, so.
And I could have tried to get that appointment in at 11, but you know what? I just did not, so. I am actually going to interrupt this video because <clears throat> I realized that I forgot to let you guys know that um, there is a PR team member call posted on my Instagram. Um, I will make sure to post the link to the um, questionnaire to like the application form uh, in the description box. And uh, yeah, you know, just read what we need, um, see if you have all that and you want to apply to participate. It's going to be November and December, so it's going to be a two-month PR term. And I hope you fill it in and we're looking forward to having you join the team. It, it is going to be a small team, so I do want to say that, um, of course, we, we look for different um, tiers of influencers. So not only like the big accounts, we also look for the smaller ones. We look for a variety of things, but the one thing that we do value very much are great quality content in terms of good quality image, uh, videos, spreads in terms of that, uh, engagement, that's also very important. Um, if I have a million followers and only 10 are engaging, like you can really tell that that million followers not quite present in engagement and also the personal engagement of the PR team. I think that's quite important as well because um, yeah, the fact that you're engaged, that you're always looking to see if there's an email from us, that you're responding in a timely manner, that um, you are committed to what you signed up for. Um, like those are the things that we're looking. Um, and yeah, if you have that, you know, read the application and we'd love to have you. Um, that's the 19th, right? So let's put these two guys down. That's a lot of appointments, I'm telling you. Okay, so on the 28th, we have Elisa's flu shot, and that is at 10 a.m. appointment. Her, um, her doctor does like a flu shot clinic, and it goes by pretty quick. Like, you get there, and she you know she has a whole bunch of nurses in their stations just getting the shots and they do it um at the lower level of the parking lot which also um is great because it's not like a super closed area i don't know i think it works really well i think they do a great job um by doing it that way now um so these are my cleaning days and I just need to mark that somehow. So what I'll do is I will go ahead and do some dots here for that. And that is how I am going to mark them. Yeah. That's exactly what I'm going to do. So on Tuesday cleaning and um, so there's going to be like a, a little bit of a different pattern here just because of an issue and I'm, I'm planning like today is Thursday when I'm planning this so um, this is why I know that it didn't happen here but I still want to put it down just because I want to be able to have that down here, right? Okay, so that's basically it. Um, I still have some uh, functionals here in case I need them. Um, and I think that's, that's it. I'm not, you know, there's nothing else that I need to put down, at least not for now. 
who knows what's going to happen later. And uh, I do know that I'm filming this a little bit late. So I'm hoping to start uh, filming November soon because I had to, um, you know, keep all these things, track of them. And I was lost without my planner. So I really need um, these uh, monthly views to set up further in advance. Uh, and again, you know, um, I'm hoping to get back on track with posting videos. And I've been filming them guys it's the editing that's becoming a little bit cumbersome to um to go ahead and edit and, and post them right so anyway here it is thank you so much for watching and take care have a wonderful rest of your week bye guys